Okay, well, I'm out on Crowling Valley today. It's like wicked hot right now. So I think the temperature is, well, the water temperature is almost 24 degrees. The actual temperature here, right, oops, right now, it, 30, it says it's 30 degrees Celsius. So it, she's warm. It's a warm day. Um, it is, uh, it's actually quite nice out here today. Um, I haven't been over on this side of the lake. I normally, I fish uh, in the summertime, we'll fish kind of like off the campground down into the, by the river outlet there, the dam. And then we usually will go up the other side and uh, on the same side as the campground and just kind of like run the bays. And you get some nice, nice pike, um, some decent, Wow, walleye. Today I got uh, a four perch um, and I've caught, I don't know how many walleye now, probably five or six. Um, and the walleye right now are actually, they're, they're pretty good. So as I'm talking here, uh, we've got something else going here. But this one is probably, feels more pike-ish. Maybe not, just a head shake. Oh yeah. Oh, maybe not. Yeah. Oh. It's got a little uh, backbone to him. Yeah. So not huge, he's pissed off as you can see. Oh, I messed up this one. It's had some tough, been caught, oh, been caught a few times. Just flip him off. Oh, or he'll break off. Um, yeah, so we've had some pretty good luck with uh, pike and walleye. So uh, today, and then obviously hitting the perch was nice too. Um, but. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna go back to my other rig. What I'm using is, uh, it's a walleye rig. That one was, that I just broke off there was uh, just a jig with a little bit of minnow on it. Um, but we've done pretty good. So this is like uh, just a little rig, just a little walleye rig. And then what happens here is, is uh, this is uh, the gulp live bait uh, leeches. And uh, just enough shine just to bring them in. They've done pretty good with them today. And then a little bit of weight on there just to, uh, to get it down to, the, to where I want for depth. Yeah, it's a beautiful day today for sure. There's a few boats out here, but not too many. And it's nice sometimes to explore over here when it's not so windy. This lake uh, can get pretty windy because we're um, out by Brooks and Bassano and that area tends to be a little windier on the lake. So when I first started out here this morning, it was a little bit windy and then uh, As of right now, it's uh, it's not too windy at all. It's actually quite nice. Uh, there's not much of a breeze. It'd actually be nice if we had a little more breeze. But yeah, I keep checking out these bays. Um, running live scope, uh, sorry, not mega live here as well. And uh, they come off the bottom pretty quick, so it's, uh, you see them when they make that big U-turn and come back for your bait, it's kind of crazy.
just a little camera shot. Oh! Not very big. Nice fish. Okay, not too thick. Not good size. He's got lots of fight in him. And he pooped all over my leg. walleye. Oh, not. That is a nice thick walleye right there. Oh, oh, oh. But okay, okay. Let's get some water. Holy shit! Oh, that's a nice walleye. Really nice walleye. Uh, let's mark another spot here. That's a nice fish. Really nice fish. Hey. Oh. <laughs> I knew they'd be in the weeds here because there's we're in about seven or eight feet of water, but I really thought it would be pike. I didn't think it would be walleye there. Just it's all weeds here. But they're like big beds, and they're, uh, yeah, it's just nice. It's nice in here for sure. Okay, so the wind is starting to pick up, so we just got to be really careful here because 
when the wind picks up here, it can get crazy. Like you can get four or five foot waves um, very, very quickly.